I remember I went to a forum there, and there was a, a Guinean student who was actually a little confused as to what his status is. He asked a question like, when he is here in the United States, they call him an African. When he goes back to Guinea, they call him an American. So where does he stand? This gentleman or young man needs to know that Guinea was once Africa. There are so many Guineas in the world. You got Guinea-Bissau, you got Guinea-Conakry, you got Equatorial Guinea. Even in the Caribbean, you got Guyana, and that is also Guinea. Even people say Guyana could be Guinea. We also got Papua and New Guinea. These are people in the Pacific Ocean, far away from Africa, but they knew where they came from. So this is the core script of Guinea, a very sophisticated writing script. This is Mandombe script of the Congo. Mandombe script of the Congo. Now, Europeans have actually brutalized everything from the Congo because of its mineral wealth. The Twa people of the Congo are called pygmies, a derogatory name, a derogatory name. They are not pygmies. In fact, the government of the Congo should change their name back, tell the world that her citizens cannot be called pygmies. But this is a script in the middle of the Congo, the Mandombe script of the Congo. This is another script. In Sibidi script of Nigeria. And they say it's a writing of the Ijamham people, examples of a few typical in Sibidi symbols, and there are many subtle variations. You got love, you got unity, you got hatred, you got divorce, you got word. You got speech, you got a meeting, got Congress. Congress, look at that. Congress. You got a mirror, a reflection, a table, a set for drink and meat. A table set for drink and meat. Trek to go on a journey. Voic and tracks. This is the Insibidi script of Nigeria. So I just want to go over certain things. The R A R E O O U is from the Vi script of Liberia. R-A-E-O-O-U. And this, how it can be worked up. You get ba be be bi bo bo bu. Ba be be bi bo bo bu. Now another uh, consonant, the D. Da de de di do do do. Da de de di do do do. Another consonant, the F. We have fa fe fe fi fo fo fu. Fa fe fe fi fo fo fu. The consonant G. We got ga ge ge gi go go gu. Ga ge ge gi go go gu. H. 
We got a ha he 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 ho ho hu. Ha he 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 ho ho hu. This is from the vice script of Liberia. A A E E O O U. This is what Africans need to go back to and get this for the young to know that we contributed to civilization. In summary, I want all of us, I want all of us to pay attention to what people say. My mentor, Listavan Middleton, said something. Minute by minute, hour by hour. As you lose your history, you lose your power. Show sharpen your eyes. Tune your ears so you know what you see and understand what you hear. This presentation is just a matter of my sankofa, my going back to the source so that I can refute Hegel with all the power that I have. But it's not just me. It's not me. It's just all of us doing it. So we today, just from the Nigerian wiki, can tell what writing actually means. The Nigerian wiki states that writing is a means by which people record, objectify, and organize their activities and thoughts through images and graphs. Nigerian witch. We have to go online and look for that because they have to be doing the great job to be referred to. Now, I did indicate the various writing systems of Africa that are known. I believe the Zulus have it, the vendors have it, and the Indebilis have it. But I did not get the information. Maybe I will expand. I'm still doing some research. And I want you, my viewers, to help me by calling divine speech in African traditionalism. 804-347-275-4910. Or you go online. Go on Google and type divine speech in African traditionalism. And you see the, our, my, our, our clips and view them and see what contributions we are doing. But these are the various writing scripts that are available to me. The Ethiopian script, the Kemetic Egyptian script, the Nubian script, Nubian, which is also the same as Sudan, the Afan or Roman script, the Basa script, Vi script, Mende script, Insibidi script, Ido Benin script, Tifunak script, Bamun script, Kukahui script, Nko script, Mandombe script, and Schumann script. Now Hegel says that we did not contribute to civilization. But listen to what this Ethiopian script is all about. Then we came to the Indunetta or the Merinetta, a writing by a god that taught human beings how to write. That god has endowed me to do this. The god's name is Jehuti. Divine speech is from Jehuti. And I'm very grateful that this god is using me to communicate with you and the masses. This is the Medoneta, the alphabet of the Medoneta. 
can be used either way. Meduneta, Mduneta is all an African right. And these are the alphabets, you know, transliterated into English. And this is my name, Ayinvisa. In Africa, when you're born, your name is your name. Now we grow up, we got a name here, a name there, and then your father's name. But in Africa, when you're born, your name is just one. And that's why I wrote this, Ayinvisa. That is exactly my name. And this, the Kemetic numerals, Kemetic script, the Sudanic Meriotic script, similar to the Mduneta or the Meduneta. The Ndebe Igbo writing script, Ndebe Igbo writing script of Nigeria. The Insibidi script of Nigeria. The Afan Oromo script of Ethiopia and Kenya. Benin Ido script and Shumon script of the Cameroon. Now here's the, the, the history of the Shumon script. That was already, you know, explained. And I want you to call again. Call me and tell me what this writing script is all about. Well, whose writing script it is. Divine speech in African traditionalism is here to answer a simple question. What are we in the world for? There are ways we communicate with a higher authority. Should we leave our own and follow somebody else? Or should we follow the instructions that were given to us when we grew up as children? This is a place for African traditionalists to come to talk. And I welcome all my viewers to call 347-275-4910. And I hope the God Amon Re will give you health, life, and prosperity. Take care.